Hello everyone. In this video of lymphatic treatment series, we will be covering the practical demonstration of pedal pump technique. This technique can be utilized by the physiotherapist to help patients who are having fever or lymphatic congestion in the lower extremities. Now many a times it happens that when a physiotherapist is seeing patient either in the hospital care setting or home environment that the patient might develop high grade fever. Now often in such a situation physiotherapy is not recommended and the patient is advised to take rest as vigorous activity or mobilization can often result in the raise of the internal body temperature and can further increase the fever and therefore through this treatment video we want to emphasize to the physiotherapy students and young practitioners that in such a scenario rather than leaving the patient with no physiotherapy at all at least we can provide the pedal pump treatment technique which will help the patient to fight fever by activation of the lymphatic system. So let's start with the practical demonstration of this technique. Now to perform the pedal pump technique the patient is made to assume the supine lying position and the heel of the patients are brought at the edge of the couch while remaining in contact with the treatment table. The therapist stands at the leg end of the table and assumes the step standing position with one leg in front of the other. Now there are two ways of performing the pedal pump technique and I'm going to demonstrate both of them. For the first method the therapist is going to place both the hands over the dorsal aspect of the foot in this manner and then is going to plantar flex the feet in the downward direction to the comfortable range. Now when the end range of the plantar flexion is met, the therapist next adds on and off rhythmic downward pressure in this manner resulting in the vibration of the whole body from toe to the head. This technique is repeated for around 2 to 3 minutes to have beneficial effects. The other way of performing the pedal pump technique is by changing the hold of the therapist. So this time I am going to hold the feet of the patient from the plantar side rather than from the dorsal side. So I am going to grab the metatarsals of the patients and wrap my fingers on the dorsal side. And this time I am going to add up force in the cephalad direction towards the dorsiflexion and when the end range of dorsiflexion is met again I am going to add up on and off superior pressure to the feet of the patient thereby again producing the rhythmic vibratory motion in whole of the body from head to toe region and this again has to be performed for around two to three minutes to have the desired effects. So this was all about the practical demonstration of the pedal pump technique. Do share physio classroom videos maximally with your contacts and help us in reaching out to maximum number of people. See you all in our next video. Till then keep learning, keep sharing and stay connected.